Hi everyone, welcome to Cash Walks. We're at Mother's Challenge at the moment. Sometimes it's called the Shouter. And we've traveled from New Zealand 19 and a half thousand kilometers or 12,000 <laughs> miles to be here. When we heard Geo Woodstock was on, the thing that convinced us finally to, dis to come was the fact that we could pop up to Mother's Challenge and give the shelter a go. Come and find out and see if we actually find it. There were a few showers through the town of Kukapu. By the time we got to the park entrance, it had cleared up. The cash was put out by Fuzzy Bee in 2007, and that's over 10 years ago, and there have been only four fines. I think it was four years before the first defined was written on the log. We parked our car, we walked to the shelter, and the search began. How are you going? Well, no luck so far. I'm going near the end of this section. <laughs> now I'm just looking up the top here. Nothing looks out of place. No, it's too neat, isn't it? It is. The whole structure is too tidy. There's just nowhere to put the thing. No. It's okay, just keep looking. We, we might find it. We might. <laughs> Get there in the end. No. You can pretty well check this one. No, nothing here. Not this time. Let's keep looking. After four hours searching, we had to admit defeat. Ah, oh, boo-hoo, we didn't find it. We looked and we looked, but we couldn't find it. <laughs> we looked at every nook and cranny. I don't think we missed anything, but we must have. <laughs> Fuzzy B, you've made an awesome hide here, and it's a did not find from us. <laughs> so thanks for watching. And don't forget to go geocaching. Well, we've just got back from the shelter for Mother's Challenge, and on the way back, we called in to see Fuzzy B, Bruce. Yeah. So he's very kindly said that we could ask him a few questions. So, um, Bruce, how did you come to hide the, um, I mean, the shelter is a fairly ordinary shelter in a park. Yeah. How did um, you come to do this? It was just a, a place I picked out at random. I had an idea for a hide. It was unique, something I'd thought of for a while. And uh, Mother was my good friend and geocaching buddy, and uh, I placed the cache there as a challenge to her so that she would stop finding caches and uh, so on, in which she never found it, of course. So She never found it? No, no, no. no. no that was over 10 years ago now. So, And do you know anything of the stats? I mean, how many people have... Um, you know, I don't know. The, no. did, the did not finds are not accurate because I know people have been there hundreds of times that don't even log. It's you know, local people yeah. that spend their lunch hour out there and stuff like that. So... Yes. Um, yeah, it's, it's been real interesting. For a long time I felt kind of guilty because of people spending all this time. I didn't expect it to get to be something like this, you know. Oh, but don't feel guilty. We, we, <laughs> we spent four hours and we enjoyed every minute of it. <laughs> you know, what people keep saying, you know, they're really, I, they're really challenged by it and they keep coming back. And it's just, it's rather fascinating. We had our 10th year um, anniversary last yes, we saw that. We had a big event there. And that's what the DNF coins were for. I'm trying to pay for the event. It was quite right. costly. So... The DNF coins are a great idea. Yeah. You know, I, I, you know, I thought, well, why not? You know, maybe they'll sell and, and we're getting rid of them. So. But we don't feel as though we're going home empty-handed either. So no. <laughs> <laughs> we've got a nice coin to take uh, with us. But we well, did have to drag ourselves away. It was quite hard to, to give up. You know, well, yeah, well, rather hot out there today, I would think, too. So It was very hot, you know. yes. And you're a little bit of conflict with the park. They're a little upset with some of the people uh, walking on the roof when it's not necessary and stuff like that. You yes. know, But that's kind of ironed out. Everybody seems to be pretty good now. Yes. Um, just last summer, I repainted the shelter. You notice that it's pretty fresh. Yes, it so we painted really the whole thing for the park just to do something for them to kind of smooth their feathers and you know. 
Okay. Yeah. So, uh, but uh, yeah, the shelter goes on. Um, a couple of the finds were a little bit too easy. The it, the cache had become exposed. Oh, right. um, the last people particularly. Um, but uh, it, it would be a lot less finders if I'd uh, been out there and maintained it a little better or a little more careful. <laughs> That's a pretty, pretty you do such a yeah. good job. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's been fun. It's been, I've really enjoyed it now. It's, you know, especially getting older and not doing as much physically. It's something to keep me going. Yeah. You know. Oh, thank you very much, Fuzzy Thank you. Thank good you. to meet you. I'm glad you enjoyed it. We did. Yeah. Very much. Thank you.